Welcome back. In this episode, we're doing the command. Okay, what we're going to do is we're going to copy that. Okay. We're going to go over to our REST plugins. We're going to add a new plugin. A new item. We're going to click here. Ah, oh, here's the name thing. There we go. I'm going to call it the command.cs. Okay. Right. In the command, we're going to go like this and wait for the errors. See? Error, error, error. The reason why we've got these errors is because this is still called the basics. So let's change this. The command. And the command. See how those errors have gone away. Okay. Right. Let's get rid of our void in it. And let's put in uh, two different types of commands. So there are two commands that you can use. There is a console command and there is a in-game command or a chat command. So let's start with a chat command. So the chat command uh, starts like this. Chat command. See, it's already auto-completed it. If I press tab, it'll chuck it in. Brackets and then whatever we want to put in. So I'm putting in test in this case. And I'm closing it off. Okay, so that is the same as writing uh, in game slash test. Okay. okay. Um, this is a void, so we're going to call it a void and we're going to call it test as well. Alright, I'm going to use the function uh, base. So I'm going to use base player. Player. Oh, yes, I'm going to do player. Player with a lowercase p. Okay. Set it up like this. Okay. What we're doing now is we're pulling information uh, from who sent the command. And what we're going to do is we're going to do a uh, basic one, which is going to be send, oops, not send error, send reply. Send reply. And we're going to send it to the player, lowercase p, same as this one. Okay. So we're sending it to this player. And we're going to say, uh, you sent the test command and I don't know why I've stuck everything in capital letter and we're going to close it off like that. Simple. There we are. That is a slash command and we're going to send a reply to the player and the player in question is the one that sent it so it's this one. You sent the test command. Okay. Uh, the other version is a console command, which, guess what? <laughs> Looks like this. Console command. And we're going to do it uh, as a different name. In this case, we're going to do uh, contest. And again, we're going to have to name our um, void. So we're going to name it contest. If you uh, set it as test, it will error out. Okay. And we're going to use... Um, Console system. Oops. Console system arguments. Console uh, system. I'm going to use arguments args. Okay. Don't actually need that in this example, but it's a good habit to start putting that in. And uh, because we're in console, we're going to use puts. Okay. And. Um, you sent the console command and finish it off like that. There we go. We have no errors. Okay, we're going to save it. We're going to upload it. I'm not going to jump into game, but we're going to upload it. We're going to open up our archon and see that it was compiled. You can also see that Bradley killed a bot, which is nice. And um, if I type in contest, it should say you sent the console command. And in game, if you do slash test, it will reply to the player. There we are, nice and simple. That is your command. 
Oh, and that's my Discord. 